Yo guys, um, JPR Tech here, and today I'm gonna talk about a problem that I recently encountered, and hopefully I could save you hours of troubleshooting. I just hung up with Apple support after trying for literally two hours on the phone, trying to fix iMessage. And what happened is I got this problem that iMessage kept uh, signing out um, automatically all of the sudden just started out this morning and after that it just cycled through that whole process every time I sign in I message will, will sign in but after four or five seconds it will close and then I'll have to sign in again and it was stuck on a loop endlessly with the help of Apple support we were able to narrow down the specific problem I have now I've searched in the forums. Users have reported that they were able to solve it just by signing out and signing in out of the Apple ID in the main computer, in the main system. Other users even reported going into the activity, monitor activity, and uh, searching for Imagen, Imagent, I don't know how it's pronounced, and forcing quit that and then restarting iMessage. So if that works for you, great. It didn't work for me. You know, forcing to quit this imagent. It might work for you, so give that a try. Now, if that doesn't work, restarting doesn't work, signing out out of iCloud doesn't work at all, and you're still stuck. And it seems like it's something connected with the validation between Apple and an iMessage. Somewhere along the lines, iMessage gets screwed up and that also affects FaceTime because as we all know, iMessage and FaceTime work hand in hand. So I'm going to show you what worked for me. And I'm telling you, this was like the last resort that the Apple Care guy, I even got escalated into an iMessage expert and he burned out all his you know, troubleshooting all his ideas. He went through all of them and we finally fixed it on his last option. So I'm here to show you what helped me in my specific problem. I still don't know what exactly went wrong, but I know how to fix that. Now you could try this at your own risk. So please take that with a grain of salt. You are responsible if you mess something up in your brand new M1 Mac. I will not take any responsibility. So if you're a little scared, you're a little concerned, stop the tutorial. Don't follow through. I'm gonna show you how to do this and what worked for me. Before you follow through this tutorial, make sure that you do have a full backup of your entire system. So if you're all ready to go, go ahead and open up Keychain Access. Now in Keychain Access, there are three searches that we need to do and we need to clear it up. So that's what's messing up with our system and uh, the searches that he made me do is first is IDS look for IDS and you're gonna find a lot of things with IDS I have no idea what it is a bunch of applications and passwords that are stored up in the keychain I have no idea what they are but anywho search IDS and select everything that is under IDS go up to edit and hit delete and you have to confirm. You have to hit delete once more. And once all that is deleted, you wanna go and check messages. And now you wanna delete everything here. Select everything and delete it. The other thing we search is iMessage, but nothing came out. And again, same thing, no results. And lastly, search for FaceTime. And you're gonna have two things that I actually deleted as well. So grab both of those delete them and restart your Mac. Once you restart, iMessages was up and running again. So there you go, guys. One more alternative, one more way to fix the problem with iMessage, keep signing out. So people, if you found this helpful, I would really appreciate a thumbs up and please do share this video because I know there are some people that really rely heavily on iMessage or first FaceTime for the work. So hopefully this video will be helpful for someone out there. And if it was, please hit the like button and hopefully I'll see you guys in another how-to video. Thank you so much for watching and see you next time.